Hey guys, what's up? Excoundrel here again with another video in my Road to Grandmaster series for Rules of Survival. This game was very sweaty. Very sweaty. Uh, so you might be able to hear my breathing a little bit. And the audio on my microphone did kind of screw up a little bit. So I hope you guys can get past that and just enjoy the video anyway. See you soon. Okay, I need to restart my game quickly. Holy moly. No idea why that's lagging out like that, but hey. Got a kill with the SMG. Let's see if I let's see if I've died. Let's see if I have died. Oh, that's much better. Wow. Two times scope. Okay, he didn't really have anything that good. Vertical foregrip, rifle ammo, M4 stock, rifle compensator. Nice, I'll take all that and I can go loot again. Hey, I got a kill with an SMG. Sorry about the start there, guys. I just, uh, I've been having this bug where when I start the game, what ends up happening is I get like a really, oh, AK. I've been telling everyone that I'm not going to use the AK, so if I can find another, if I can find another um, rifle, I'll use that instead. The bug that I've been getting is that when I start up the game, I'm getting like clipping and it really badly clips on the audio and it's really annoying and I get really bad FPS drops. So essentially I just can't play the game. So I have to keep restarting until it doesn't do that. And unfortunately it took me about four goes to get it to work this time around. But I got a kill, so um, somehow got a kill. Don't think I really deserved that kill, but I got one. I'm really looking for an M4, like an M4 or an AKM. I just want to... Not an AKM, sorry, an AR-15. Because I really want to try out a new uh, rifle. I told you guys I would not use the AK if I could if I could sort of get away with it. Let's have a look. Uh, let's put the two times on the AK for now, because it's probably the one that I'm more likely going to be using. Ah, uh, here we go. That's an M4, right? So, if I go and take that off, take that off. Get the M4, nice. Get that, go here. I've already got it all installed. Wonderful. So, we're going to be using the M4 this game for a little bit of a change. Since I uh, I told you guys I would sort of just change it up ever so slightly. Uh, pan. Got another M4 here. Nice, I've got enough of AR ammo. Don't really need any more AR ammo for this game. But what I could do with is a helmet. So, let's see if I can find a helmet. I kind of dove to a completely random location I just picked up an AR even though I, AR, even though I just said I don't need AR I uh, haven't looted this building over here so I dove to like a I like to dive to completely isolated areas sometimes just for the simple fact that in this game it is really not hard oh four times lovely in this game it's really not that hard to find um, rifles so you're never going to be in, in a tough position in terms of uh, actually needing ammo because everywhere has guns, even the really crappy locations. If this was PUBG and you, you dove to a, a farmhouse with three, <laughs> with just like three random houses, you'd be lucky enough to find a pistol, let alone a rifle. But alas, we've got level two armor. We got away from the early game despite the FPS drops and the weird lag. And now we are pushing into the circle, which will be at thermal power. Now, level 2 helmet, exactly what the doctor ordered. Okay, we're actually in a good position now. We've got a compensator on M4, pretty much a fully kitted out M4, except for that, which I can put onto my M4. In fact, I don't even want my SMG. No, it's just taking up space. I'm never going to use my SMG if I get the opportunity to not do so. So here's where we look around thermal power and see if uh, anybody has actually gone to thermal power thermal power is okay for a drop like it's not it's not like got huge amounts of stuff but I, I quite like thermal power because not many people like going there and again i'm one of those guys that looks to avoid the early game fights because they're a bit like they're a bit 50 50 like i like to climb i'm looking to climb i'm not looking to sort of just get kills uh, and the early game fights can often be like who gets a good gun essentially uh, hollow sight, no. I'll take a red dot sight because red dot sights are probably better up close, but I just can't stand the hollow sight. I just can't function with it for some reason. 
but yeah, I'm one of those guys that really doesn't like taking the sort of the early game battles because I just always feel like the early game battles come down to who gets a gun and and what gun is it? Are you lucky enough to get a gun first? You know, did the room that you chose to enter first have a, a spawn? So I I just just don't feel like the uh, the effort is worth it for trying to go for these really random early game battles. Let's have a look. What is that? That's level one armor. Got level two. I'm stuck. Okay. Okay, game. Thank you. Let's keep going. Not really. Okay, this has definitely been looted because there's an AK there with no ammo. Which does mean I have to be careful because the guy is probably looted and moved on by now. <laughs> That's fine. More people for me to kill. No, I am... You know, I've been told that the AK's recoil is just too hard to deal with. Got a vertical foregrip, nice. Um, so I'm going with the, I'm going with the M4 this time just to try it out. Um, you know, I, I'm doing it on the recommendation of my commenters. You know, I, I I listen to you guys. I'm willing to learn at this game because realistically, I'm I'm a vainglory player and a vainglory um, expert in some ways. I'm not a rules of survival expert, but I try to use the fact that I like to sort of approach games tactically to give me an upper edge in the game. I've only got one kill so far, and I got the kill simply by, if I'm completely honest, the guy was just bad, and uh, missed every shot, and he had an AR, and uh, I had an SMG. Although the SMG up close doesn't seem to be too bad. Like, I, I think I gave the SMG too much too much crap when I first, uh, first sort of started playing this game. I really didn't like the SMG, but honestly, up close and personal, as long as you don't, like, spam it and lose control of your recoil, it's a pretty good, uh, a pretty good gun to have. I would always uh, get rid of it for an AR though when I get the opportunity. And there was some shots over here. I've got a four times, so I can afford to uh, scope people out if I can see them. Now the mistake I made in the last game was kind of disrespecting the fact that people can just prone. You know, people can just prone, and also people can just sit in bushes, and it can be very hard to find them. So. I don't want to make that mistake again. I'm going to be really vigilant on the bushes. There's a guy. Nice. Pretty sure there was a guy driving very close to me. He also looked like he was engaging in a fight, and I actually completely agree. The recoil, even on single shot M4, was way better there, fully stocked out. So, uh, where is that? Where is that close? It feels like that's really close, but it's not telling me where it's coming from, so. Take that. Send the quick draw mag. Could do with a uh, could do with a silencer. Shots are coming from that location. Don't know exactly where. Maybe they are from the house. Could be a little bit further. Kind of gave away my position with all the shots that I fired though. So I've got to be a little, at least a little bit careful here. And there's definitely some shots coming from that way. If I'm just patient, I can, I can. Okay, there's a car coming right behind me. I'm gonna. He hasn't seen me. I hid from him behind the tree, and now I might be able to sneak up on him. Oh shit, he's right there. <laughs> uh, 
That was too good. Rifle silencer. That's what I want. Oh, and he's got a sniper rifle. I'll take the sniper rifle on a four times scope flash hider. If I can take the red dot sight as well. That was good. I'm going to drop that. Yeah, get rid of my two times scope. I've got two times. I'll drop one. Kind of want that red dot sight. Where'd that red dot sight go? Uh, I think I dropped it somewhere. There we go. Get away. Okay, I see what you guys mean about being able to control the recoil on these guns way better. Holy moly. That is a massive change. Like, I've never been able to auto someone down before. That was ridiculous. I'm going to just reload this. But holy moly, guys, that was crazy. Re the recoil control on this gun compared to the AK is just ridiculous. I just hadn't given it enough. I hadn't given it enough credit. There was still someone shooting that way. This is what I mean about being quiet and trying to approach things stealthy. There's shots this way. I don't want to get. I'm a, the reason I'm approaching these shots is that I don't want to get someone turn up behind me and kill me. So. I'm confident in my ability to out-duel these guys. Oh, there's going to be people turn up behind me, isn't there? I don't want to get, like, approached behind and just end up losing these shots. They're probably firing from those apartment buildings. I actually need to be careful from people coming this way, which is the worst thing. Given that I already have the edge of the circle, I can just try and find a place to sort of sit on the edge of the circle. Because there was definitely at least some fire coming from this direction. So people are going to... Yeah, yeah, I thought there were. Where from? Where was that from? It was in that direction, so... They'll have to come this way. They will have to come this way. <laughs> I'm out of the circle, but I don't have to travel very far. There we go. Nice. That was pretty good. That was that was good because now I don't think I have to worry. Who was he shooting at though? Was he shooting at that guy over there? Because he killed someone. I don't want to just be complacent and think that that was the only guy. But I feel like that was the guy that I have to worry about coming from that direction. So let's not stress too much. Carry on. Another vehicle. Hiding. I'm just going to wait. He stopped. Why do people do this? Everybody does this. They just kind of, they just kind of walk up to the level three armor. Nice. Thank you very much. All they do is they just kind of, they kind of walk up in a, in a vehicle. It's really noisy. And then they just get out of the vehicle at the edge of the circle. Like people play the edge of the circle, guys. Be more careful about where you drive. If you drive, you've got to go the whole hog and drive all the way to the center, I think. I usually did. I usually use the vehicle for the first part. I use a vehicle for the first part of getting to the circle and then everything else I do on foot because it's... There's more shooting. Why is that 
guy is shooting. Like, shooting a... A guy is shooting an empty vehicle. It's confusing where he's shooting from, but I feel like he's... I feel like he's on the roof of that building. Or in a window or something. But why would you just be giving away your position like that? Like, he just, like, needlessly... I, unless there is someone behind that car. Unless there is someone behind that car, which actually sounds like that could be the case. It sounds like there could be someone behind that car. Given that you would just not be shooting an empty car for no reason. Which means I got away very, very luckily that... Which means he must have been in sight. So maybe he's behind that. Is he behind there somewhere? Like, where would that guy have been? I don't think I've got time to figure it out. I've got to cross the road, which is the worst part. Which is the worst part of this. So I'm just going to hug this edge of the circle. It could be that other these other guy hugs the edge of the circle. So I'm going to stick to auto, because controlling this gun in auto is a lot easier than controlling it. Uh, the AK. I've been missing out. I have been missing out. Is that him there? Nice. There was definitely someone. He was doing the same tactic as me. I just so happened to uh, do it a little bit better. Naisu. Let's carry on. It's starting to move in though, so I'm going to have to be a little bit more aggressive with my running tactic here. Just got to get into the circle. I don't think he'd have made it that easily. I think he would have got stuck in the circle if he was doing He was running a little bit late. Like, he ran a little bit late there. I can afford to run this way and run to the side, simply because the circle closes in slower on this side. Although I don't know if I can afford to lay, uh, crouch down. Hmm. How do I get myself into a good position? Like, what is a good position at this point? There was a vehicle somewhere. Oh, for, for goodness sake. Okay, well, I'm going to wait. Going to wait for everyone else to start moving and try and pick them off with a silence. Uh, I'm not going to not going to absolutely rush my way to this circle. Because I am very much in one of the worst positions. I also think that someone might have been in that little shack. Okay, that's not anybody. I thought that might have been someone looked like somebody I have only got 55 seconds to do this though so I've got to be careful goodness me where is everybody there's only six people left and I don't know where any of them are can't even predict where any of them are there was definitely someone driving around in a vehicle though so we know that much for sure oh, I'm certain there's going to be people coming from Maze Out Factory there's got to be right Let's just get close enough to the circle that we can hold out. This is the risky part. Because now it's all about who catches who. Mm. 
you can't stay in these buildings, you're going to have to move. Shots fired straight in front of me. Where are those shots coming from? Okay. I have got like no cover here. He was up there. I see him. Okay. Nice. I have taken a lot of damage to my body armor, though. You're probably going to have to move again. There's a guy literally right there. Okay. It's me versus someone else. Me versus one other dude. Come on. Me versus one. Is that him there? Nope. Makes me think that he's already in the circle. Gonna go to auto now. Hello. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Easy, easy game. With an eight, you guys are right. I can't, can't fault you for that. You guys were right. So hopefully you guys can get past the robot sounding audio that I had going on there. Uh, I apologize for it. It was a, 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 an issue that comes up with my microphone and it forces me to restart my microphone sometimes. Uh, I didn't realize that it was happening during the game when I was recording. Anyway, I'll see you guys soon and uh, I'll have another video on my road to Grandmaster series probably this weekend, maybe uh, Monday or something like that. Uh, and we'll continue to put out rules of survival content because again, I just kind of, it's quite a fun game and I really enjoy it.